Welcome to Yumco. Are you ready to order? Sam, look how sick Josh is. It's your fault, you brought us here. It's not my fault he's not feeling well. I eat at this cafe every day, and I've never had anything like it. You were right, Ethan, it's cheap and tasty enough. Now you know that a good meal isn't always expensive. Understand that according to MLB rules the home team always starts the match in defense, which means that in every innings they will have the last opportunity to change the score in the game. Heh, inning, the end of the eighth inning, it was in some game, I do not remember what its name is. Major Payne gave only 5 minutes to eat, and I think Private Jonathan hid my shoes again. Yeah, I forgot to tell you, Sarah has a devoted friend, Sammy. Sammy lives with Sarah for 9 years and never left her. Even now he's waiting for her at the coffee shop where she drinks coffee every day. not working. You wouldn't have a couple of cents, would you? Once they entered the subway and got on the train, they were home in 20 minutes. Served Sammy, who was sitting next to her for 10 minutes, and saying that he was hungry. Well, okay.
after feeding her devoted friend, it's time to get back to the laptop and continue the work. Sarah's dream was interrupted by a loud knock. Strongly afraid, she tried to catch her breath and fall asleep again, and to completely calm down, she petted Sammy, and he licked her hand. After a couple of hours, the window that seemed to be tightly closed, opened bursty and closed with a powerful blow. It scared Sarah so much that she almost cried out of fear, but Sammy licked her hand again, letting her know that he was near, and that everything was alright. Through an already shallow dream, Sarah heard the sound of falling drops. She was wary and thought she hadn't closed the tap, but she was very tired and scared enough to go and check, so she fell asleep again. Woke up again because of the sound of the drops, and thought she couldn't work if she didn't sleep, and found the strength to get up and close the faucet. When she got out of bed, she felt the familiar touch of the tongue. Taking the phone, Sarah went to look for the noise source. You have very tasty fingers.